Welcome back everybody to Farming Simulator 17 here on Low Creek Farms. Y'all ready for another awesome episode? At least I hope it's awesome. It's awesome to me. Folks, We I went ahead and borrowed another 10000 Yeah, I know, right? I quit borrowing money. But I had to get the other bagger part of this. It's the auger part that unloads it. So we're going to unload this canola, which is 103,499 liters. And there goes the canola getting unloaded. Wow, this thing unloads fast. But that's good because we ain't got no time to wait. We got to get bailing some uh, silage. There we go. We uh, hop out. Oop. I guess I need to come back down to earth, don't I? We're going to get on our bob truck here. Alright, good. What? Oh man. Just unloaded what was in the pipe. Okay, well. It's still going to be a little bit left. We'll have to come back and get it. But uh, 28,499 liters left. Let's go ahead and shut uh, our tractor off here. And I'm going to just pull out to the main road here and we're going to start a GPS, not, not a GPS, but a course play route. Let's see, I want to go farm shop to store. Now we're going to drive now, no uh, workload or nothing. And stop at the last trigger. All right, while well, he's going, uh, got three of our cows here. Where's the fourth? All right, who's who, who's missing? Where's Bubba at, ladies? Where's Bubba? We still got Bubba. Let me check, make sure. Yeah, we still got four cows. Okay, that, that scared me there for a minute. Yeah, I know, right? Y'all go find Bubba. Make some more cows. We need to get on up here. Get get the cow population up there, girls. All right. Anyway, we're going to go to Moore's. All right. Chrome Big M500 wide. I know this is going to be a little bit unrealistic. But, folks, it's going to help me out a lot. It's going to help out a lot. 75000 I only got 7000 No problem, because we're only going to lease it for maybe a couple of days this enough to get our pastures mowed and uh, hopefully we can mow them I should have checked that before I bought it let's double check that real quick uh, let's go to our map um, what I want to do is go down here to grass okay you see all that grass or pastures all right good um, we got a lot that's in the second stage, look like, and uh, we still got some in our first stage. That big old, yeah, bright yellow circle there is what we done last time. So we we got quite a bit that we can do. And like I said, uh, Jason Colin and them has been going around cutting a lot of trees. Yeah, I know, Bubba. I, I, I mean, uh, Betsy. I got I gotta go. Uh, Morgan's supposed to deliver that mower over here. Oh yeah, right here it is. All right, and you can see right here it's not quite fully grown compared to that over there by the building, but it's gonna be enough. Let's take a look on the inside. Whoa, I'm sitting high. Got a buddy seat. Got our controls. Uh, I don't know, what is that up there, a wiper maybe? Got wipers on the side glass? Oh yeah, look at all these buttons up here. Start her up. She sounds good. Uh, we're probably going to start right here in this field. Let's get this thing unfolded. Now there is a catch to this thing. Um, 
you know, the creator tools, you have to A on the keyboard, or at least that's what I got mine set to. But uh, we're going to lower it down. I can use it like this, but I can also hit L. And say, so, like I said, it takes me to that. But look how wide this thing is now, folks. And also, and let's see here. I need to make sure these flaps are down. Yeah, the flaps are down at the back. If you raise the flaps up, it'll mow and leave the grass on the ground right where it's at. But if the flaps are down, it'll wind roll. So let, let's turn this bad boy on. And say, let's let's go out here and start. Oh, she's fast too. Uh oh, auto save. There we go. Boom, 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 boom. We're just going to start right here. All right. Well, I needed to course play this is what I need to do, but I'm just going to test her right now. And there she is. You can see that wind roll right there behind her. Let's go up a little bit and see all the grass is getting piled right in the center. And don't worry, the, the first part of the wings are not collapsible. But that's going to help us out a lot, folks. But right now... We're going to kill this, and we're going to go get our bob truck, because it's already been up there, and I want to sell that, get get this right here all done, so we're going to stop driver, close that out, and don't worry, I'm not selling it right now, but I am thinking about selling the truck, bob truck, and next year, renting a uh, bigger and better one. All right. Whoa. Oh, man. I just barely tapped it. I was hitting my brakes. Life's a rock. In that case, concrete. All right, here we go. I'm going to unload. You can here and see these animations. Let me pull up a little bit. So I'm on the grate instead of having to do a lot of cleanup. Um, we are selling this for $353, so we're not going to get that much out of it. 18,000, no, 17,689. Now that is not bad at all. Oh, it's going to spill out. Oh, I sure got over some. Oh, I went in pretty good. Not too much clean up. We might get another one of these J&M wagons. Not for sure. See, that was $8,405. Bringing us a total of $26,745. Okay, so that's not bad. Alright, we're going to get uh, Jason or somebody or Jonathan to store to farm. To uh, take us back for us, drive course, stop at the last. Oh, there they go. Um, we got to get our baler. We don't need to take the auger, whack, the gravity wagon back, so we're just going to load the bob truck up when it gets back. But uh, this is what we need right here. And I got the uh, disc and the, the bagger system itself over there. Now, this thing can pull the uh, the coon behind the monster over here, what I want to call it. Let's see, I got my bell counter reset. And let's see, wrap bells is on. Feel like we're good to go. So I'm just gonna get behind it here. 
and uh, it looks like it's going to pick it up all right so control F and I probably want about whoa, 25 meters about 25 meters behind so he's going to be good to go yeah, I gotta watch that bob truck when it comes around the corner there. We're gonna go ahead and get this off the screen. We're gonna start her back up. Uh, let's go mowing, folks. Now, this thing can do 15 mile an hour. But I don't want it to do 15 mile an hour. I want it to do about 10. Oh. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Gotta hop out, gotta hop out. Uh, yep, Jason's flying like a... I can't say that <laughs> on uh, YouTube, but uh, well, I can, but I don't want to. There are some kids out there that watch my channel. I just wish my own kids would watch my channel. Hint, hint, Jacob. Hint. <laughs> but anyway... Oh, I wish it. I'm going to go ahead and unhook the trailer. And, uh. Now let's watch it, see what it does when that. There it goes. We're back to the regular bag system. And we can carry this bag with this. All we have to do is raise our wheels up. Of course, I got to start the tractor up. And just like that, we're gone. So I'm going to park this guy right here. Oh, wow. We done made two bales. Oh, that's what I need done. Oh, I forgot about that, folks. Ah, get out of there. Let's go ahead and send this guy on. We're going to let him take the gravity wagon anyway. Um, I know it's kind of a waste waste of time there but uh, farm shop to store drive course stop at the last now we gotta find our John Deere I got all them running all right here we go that's one reason why I wanted some money we're gonna repair Six hundred eighty dollars. That's not bad. Uh, that's a couple oil changes there, but uh, yeah, it's done. I uh, want to customize this tractor. We are going to take the duals off. Hopefully, yeah, basic right there. That's all we're going to do. Customize, yes. I know. Oh my God. Don't look like a beast no more. But anyway. Got to start it up. Let's get out of here. We got to hook up to our trailer. We don't have our truck no more. We're going to have to get us a truck. Alright, there we go. I'm going to switch over. Got to do my gray box here. Let's see. Work position, pallets. No, nope, we won't. Uh, should be that right there. Work position. Alright. Oh, wrong button. There we go. Right, let's go on around here and let's pick up some bales. Got our pumpkins outside in the yard there. Have y'all ever seen this? I don't know if I ever actually showed this to y'all or not. I think I might have, but but uh, when fall or not, that's the fall one there. Um, we do have a uh, winter one with a snowman Santa Claus. All right, let's see if it's going to pick us up. All right, there we go. Go ahead and pick that right there up, folks. We're getting ready to make some money now. Hopefully. Uh, let's see here. Control F. I do want to go. That's probably going to be the wrong side. But uh, I'll go back about 25. 
Now if I ain't the right one, we can change it here in a minute. Kind of noisy. All right, <laughs> I should have stayed out for a second. I think he's going to switch sides. Alright, let's stretch this knob for right there. Um, that should be about right. Oh yeah, go, 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 go. Yep, he's gonna stay on that side right there. So that's good. Let's uh get to our Chevy. Stop driver. Took the Chevy to the levee, but the levee was dry. The good old boys was oh, there I go, I can't say the rest of it. Because of YouTube. I go to Twitch and say it. But then again, I want to keep my channel family friendly. You know, ain't no sense in cussing and stuff like that. It just don't make you look good. Or at least that's what I've always been taught. Kind of nasty and ugly. All right, I didn't think that thing was that slow. They're dumping up pretty fast, so. All right, what is that? 9,342 for a harvest. So I add all that up. I think y'all can do that. And that's what we got out of that. Uh, what was it? Field one and two for canola. All right, store to farm. Drive course. Stop at the last. And that's all we're going to see of that. Oh, there we go. Now we're going to do some mowing, folks. Now, like I said, you know, I got to do that, so to do 10. And the reason why I'm going 10, if I do the 15, I'm outrunning the baler. And if I outrun the baler too long, see who's working. can't see because they're so close together and I'm pulling up the wrong one to look I need to pull this up it looks like we got birch birch video 573 and Sarah yeah that's what we got Sarah and birch video 573 go check them out folks down below in the description box and also while you're there if you're feeling generous don't forget to hit the PayPal PayPal button but only if you want to. I'm not begging for money. Some folks might think I am, but I'm not. But I'm just gonna keep at 15 and show y'all right here. I need to get GPS set up too. See, they got two bells right there. Now how is that working out with two bells? Probably because I stopped or something. But this is going to make it a lot easier and a lot faster. And we might just end up buying this guy. Let's see, I think I want to go over this one more and then I'll tilt it about, about right there anyway, because it should get it. And there goes uh, probably Jason. Right, now I'm locked on GPS. I'm just going to go to 10. Um, I'm going to do this field here. And that field there. And then I'm going to come back on. And I'm going to GPS or course play the field back behind the barns. Uh, over that way. Yeah. And... Uh, I'll come back on and show y'all where I'm at. Um, first thing I want to do is fill 
our barn up right there with sellage bales and then I'm gonna start selling Let's see I just want to take slow wide turns go ahead and lock the GPS back on oh don't turn we're just going to keep it just like that all right I'm gonna stop right here but well, folks I will be back in just a second all right everybody I told you I'll be back in a second all right I'll show you the map first right here the purple that's what I already harvested in grass and uh, we got Donna and Jason here fixing to help us in what I call the grass field one. Pretty much this is the new uh, boundary line from here to here down to here. So um, let's get them started. All, all three of these are going to be animated. Or I guess that's the right turn. Get over here where it's sort of quieter. But that's the map that uh, we're going to be doing. And we might see that. Oh, this little bump right here. Well, that's a uh, ditch I went around, and uh, a little one right there, a little stub ditch. But here we are. We're fixing to start. So I already set up grass field number one, but I got a big M, 22 meter. Uh, this is actually 23.5, but I cut it down just to make sure we get everything. So, um, what I'm going to do, we're already running. We're going to start mowing. Let me get this map off here. We're going to start mowing a little bit till we get under and past this little trigger here. Okay. Oh, one thing. I want to make sure we got our things extended out there. Alright, now we're going to nearest waypoint. We're going to drive course. And that should do it, folks. I am out a little bit. I just want to make sure everybody will miss the fence line and stuff. You know what? I got a problem already. No, not with them. Uh, not with them. I got a problem with this guy. Uh, actually, this was Donna. But, uh, anyway, we're going to quit following. And then we're going to load course. Course. I can't even talk right. Uh, we're going to load. Uh, the same one as the big M. Uh, so, so, yeah, there we go. Big M, 22 meter. It should put us right at the same. We'll put work mode. Uh, nearest waypoint. Drive course. And of course, he's going to miss the turns, but. close that out so we can see and we're going to have some bales we have to pick up that's going to get straggly like that but we that ain't no big deal as long as this thing can run the course well, I can always just go and uh, imaginary pretend I got the strength to pick these guys up and throw them right <laughs> I know they ain't realistic but folks we check this right here It's not going to give us a reading. So, you know, it's not going to give us reading of the hump. It's just giving us a reading of this because it's going to be the same. See? But anyway, we're going to come back in a little bit and check on them. Who do we have anyway? We got. can't tell on that map. I'm going to have to go down here where I can zoom in. 
Our big M is already down here. Oh, we got Jason on one of them. I wish they would tell the name. This guy, see, this Baylor can't keep up, so there may be a problem. I don't know. I just have to see. Let's tab around. Oh, we got Jamie on that. One. Okay. They're at 14 mile an hour. I want to. Well, I can't slow him down because he's on course play speed. But so I had to let him go and I had to. I don't know, get another baler or something. What? We should be able to get this grass up. Should be. Um, it will disappear overnight and lose condensity within the air what's being out here. But uh, anyway. Uh, nope, I need that. Let's go ahead and uh, go over here and feed our cows. It's getting that time. Our rations are down. But as you can see there, from those other two fields, whoa, we got uh, 500 512,000 liters, 120 bales stored in here, and this thing is full. So what I need to do, uh, get some grass bales and some hay bales. I don't need that much grass bales, so. See if I can make it in here. I don't know if I dump here or dump on the other side. Oh, it's showing dump here. Okay, good. I don't have to pull all the way through. Uh, okay, it won't let me dump here. I'm hitting the buttons. I'll make sure I'm hitting the right buttons. Right B and Y. Unload. Oh, it's not letting me do it, folks, so. Oh, they all would be here, too. Let's see if I can unload on this side. No. Girls, I wish I would get out of my way. I'm trying to feed y'all. Oh, well, we're waiting on them to move. All right, Rosie heard me. Let's go over here. You can see how it's down in orange air on power food. Everything else pretty good. Health is 68. Now, I was watching, uh... Oh, yeah, I know. I'm trying to get y'all out of the way. Come on, Betsy. I can get in here close enough. Aha. There we go. Now see, this thing don't never empty out. I'm going to have to try to get me another one or something. But this thing don't never empty out. And I, I, I don't like that. It, it filled it up, but... It just ain't right, folks. But anyway, we're going to go park this. Um, that's going to take us and put the rest of it in there. And it's a little storage. Alright, folks, hang on. I'm, I'm going to be right back. All right, sorry about that interruption, folks. I'm fixing to have to get off here. There is a bad storm coming, and that was uh, 
Junior Unit 10 who's uh, with me on Skywarn and also medical calls he helps me out pretty good but uh, anyway the, the story is uh, the main storm's over by Cersei but the uh, all of a sudden uh, there's a line or a cold front or something that popped up the closer than what we thought and uh, it's getting pretty good size the the main one back by Cersei is uh, got tornado warnings and stuff in it so we're kind of thinking that this one's going to pop up and get strong and uh, we just have to be careful because we're on the edge of the Mississippi River uh, we're not even half a mile away from it and they seem to get intensified when they get closer to the river but uh, I'm just looking around showing you all know, put the disc in here and our bagger system for right now um, here later on I know we don't have enough right now but uh, when we start selling these other spells I'm going to get more cows so um, wait did I just see oh wrong one let's pull up our mini map oh it looks like they're running upon each other let's go see what's going on see this should be the third headland so when he gets back around he should be start going up and down who is he anyway Jamie sorry it's a she and we got uh, Bama girl Amy all right Bama girl Amy and we also got who's, who's on this one Oh, uh, Jason's on that. Okay. Did I set those trailers to pick up? I hope I did. Yeah, work position. I know that is on. And that's work position. Okay. And oh yeah, I don't know if I showed y'all this or not, but I did buy the bumper. And it just pushes them. But <laughs> as you can see there it pushes them where it starts rolling in the wrong direction but uh, I know what I can do and it'll probably be more legit ooh careful there Jamie don't break the wings off good lord well, this is the one I need well folks I'm fixing it off here and uh, I know I probably should record this a little bit more but like I said, these storms are popping up. And ah, come on, I will save. Whew. That scares me every time. I don't need this bucket, so we'll leave it right there. So then why ain't I turn it? All I'm going to do is, uh, to make this a little bit more legit, I'm gonna put the bell spikes on. I think we still got them. Oh, things are probably in the way. Yeah, we got them right here. We just have to kind of maneuver around the seed pallet and. Oh, there we go. But, uh, our uh, storage area here getting pretty good size. Just need to reorganize it a little bit. Let's see, where are we at? We are out this way. And best way to get to that, folks, is right through here. This, uh, yeah, work position. All right. Oh, no, 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 no. We're going to close this one. Wrong one. 
wrong one. I have to go through a double gate that way. But folks, when we come back, we're going to be doing more villain. More villain. Um, I'm just going to stockpile the money. I'm going to sell bales, sell bales, sell bales. And why can't I move? Oh man, my game froze. Yep, my game froze. Alrighty then, that's not good. Alright folks, well, I'm gonna have to see y'all later. I'm gonna have to reset everything. I hope I didn't lose that much. Auto save usually works pretty good. But I do start hearing the thunder anyway. So I'm going to have to get off here. Y'all have a great day. A blessed day. Be safe if you're in the area of these storms. But folks, I will see y'all later.